Hi, this is Eric Bjornstad with another edition of the Belk Performance video blog. And today we're going to talk about fuel additives. More specifically, we're going to talk about how can you tell when you are recouping what you spent on that fuel additive. How do you know when you're saving more than what you spent on it? Uh, in the fuel additive industry, there are two main types of fuel additives, two main classes. There are one-shot additives like STP, and then there are concentrate additives like Bell Performance. Now, a one-shot additive, and again, STP is probably the most famous, well-known of those. Uh, they, those are the 8 or the 10 or the 12-ounce bottles that you find on the store shelves. They're called one shot because obviously you just take the whole bottle, you put, you dump the whole thing into your gas tank. It has enough active ingredients in that one bottle to treat one tank of fuel. And an STP, which is one of the least expensive, they'll cost four to five dollars to treat that one tank of gas. Now, if you break this down mathematically, if it costs five dollars after tax, or you know, give or take five dollars. Five dollars, and you got a 15-gallon tank. Then you're spending about 33 cents per gallon in order to treat that one tank of fuel. Now, uh, if you think about it in terms of gas mileage, okay, gas mileage is the thing that everyone's concerned about because it's the thing that everyone can see, and it's also the thing that's most quantifiable as well. Uh, a fuel additive may claim to clean your engine out, and it may actually do that, and that's important to do. But a, a the average driver can't see that happening, so it doesn't resonate with them in the same way that gas mileage does when they go to the pump and they know that they've just gone 20 miles more than they did before. You know That's important to them, and so that's why we talk about gas mileage a lot. So, if you're paying 33 cents per gallon and it's $3.30 for uh, a gallon of gas, then you know that you're paying about 10% of that price, and that means that in order to just to break even with that bottle of STP, you've got to get 10% better mileage. Now, 10% is not uh, an outrageous figure. It's certainly not out of the realm of possibility for somebody to get, but that's 10% just to break even. Uh, and most people don't buy things just to break even. Just like an investor doesn't invest money to just to, to, to make no return, a person doesn't take the trouble to buy a fuel additive just to save the same amount that he spent. Now, a concentrate like what Bell Performance makes, a 32-ounce bottle of ethanol defense will cost about $25. But... A 32-ounce bottle will treat 320 gallons of fuel. Not 20 gallons or 15, but 320. If you run that out mathematically, that's about $0.08 cents per gallon. So now you're getting a much lower percent gain that you have to make back in terms of gas mileage in order to break even. Uh, and and uh, eight cents per per gallon into three dollars and thirty cents, so or three dollars and twenty cents. You're looking at about maybe uh, three to four, maybe even as low as two and a half percent mileage gain that you've got to make in order to regain everything that you spent on that bottle of concentrate. So concentrates are much more cost effective uh, than one shots are. Uh, essentially, when you buy a one-shot, you're paying for the convenience. And there's nothing wrong with that, certainly. Bell Performance does make one-shot versions of our mix -a go and our Diesel uh, fuel additives. But uh, if, you're, if you're trying to save, if you're trying to get the best value possible, then look at concentrated fuel additives instead of one-shots. And always keep in mind uh, that it's really the mathematics that determines uh, whether or not you are really getting back everything that you paid for. So thanks for joining me today on this uh, Bell Performance video blog. Um, if you like this blog, then please feel free to like it on YouTube. Uh, and you can always become a subscriber of the Bell Performance video cha blog channel as well. Again, this is Eric Bjornstad with Bell Performance. Thank you very much for joining me today, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.